circumstances may be what they am. I know. Hello, welcome to HTV. My name is Beg Duhana from Realize Your Dream Foundation. Um, we introduce you to our director by name John Adverte to give us a lecture on this program today. So now let us welcome Mr. John Adverte. Hello again and welcome to As she rightly mentioned, my name is John Agbote. We are from Realize Your Dream Foundation. And in collaboration with HTV and uh, Ama Theater, we have put together this program today. And we are going to enjoy it. But before then, let me start to introduce to you the wonderful people around who have made this program a success. As we are all here now, we are being hosted by the owner in the name of Father Mustafa. <laughs> to my extreme left is Brother Peter Bamfo from Realize Your Dream Foundation. And my immediate left, Brother Jean. Brother Jean happens to be one of the originators of this program. Actually, the idea was partly born by him and the owner of this place. So we are grateful to be here with him today. To my immediate right, is Nicholas Tete, brother Nicholas Tete. And to the far right is Hannah Bedu, all of Realize Your Dream Foundation. Then my name again is John Agbote. I'm also one of the directors of Realize Your Dream Foundation. Then we are all here, we are all being led by the founder of Realize Your Dream Foundation. She's actually the, the, the chairperson or the CEO of this foundation, in the person of Antoinette Oday. So we are here, as I mentioned, we are into reproductive health. And programs like this, we, we see this opportunity to educate, to create awareness among the youths so that we can be able to avoid certain potholes in life in order to achieve our ultimate goals as matured adults. I hope you are going to enjoy this program. Thank you very much. Now we call upon our first um, speaker, which is Mr. Nicholas Tete. Thank you very much, and once again, you are welcome to HTV. Now, I'm going to present on a topic called the family planning. I know most of you have heard about family planning. Let me tell you, I told you, Nicolas Tete, in Kenya, about family planning. I look, but no, but I don't know, 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 wo be ne yo ya nasani alo nu ya nasani shini e a febro fo yo mo e wo ma yo le bro fo fi o ke nke ba gam ke fe ni wonu wo fe wo botu eni wonu nsi ojugba mi ya mi he aye mi he aye ake no ni yo e o ba kole na kan no okay benin ton yen yo e ka ke family plan ye mo fi amo ye edomoni e ba nye eton ke ton he when we say family planning, you can explain it in your own way. She ke wo kwe wo enji we noni wo ba ke ji eke family planning e ji beji ana we sni bo nu e alo yo e o ba decide beni o ba fo beni o ba tono no kwe beke biye ke beke biye ah makola ke in the future boni amama ba tashi uni eka ba ke ame ya basani ku. Nikake sani ebanye fe ila ebanye fe shikasani ebanye fe ni mi api 
e wo mincha no ni wo ken be na e ba bi mi questions e wo makola ke be na mi ele nyeka filia shy nyeka filia shy on kesa sane be e she nya bi asane fe sane nya nto nya bi okay Okay, family planning allows individual and couples to anticipate and attend their desired number of children and the spacing and timing of their birth. It is achieved through using of contraceptives method and the treatment of involuntary infertility. Ke min chon min kemba gami e chon ke kake family planning e be kone we me jomo fia ma ke okay blay we ya kotofa alo nwe e ya uroba alo condom. She jena kani family planning your chong. A jig bejian ni ni ato ni bo. You alone nu ni oyo be a biantone. O banya ni ole ake o ba boy bain alo o ba boy modeni o fe ni eka bake wo bene oya fo pi no nyo kwe. Ni ke balena ke beja we kume na bamo bebri e nyak bamo pi ba mi. Wani o ye jeno kaba chebu. Onye mi yu ama e fo e e beshka. Ke bale na kanye, e gba na pi yi. E wo ba chon ni bi fi o kokeke. Wo le fe, fi o ni wo yo no ba chon ni e wabu. Ni min chano, e ke? It is achieved through use of contraceptive method. I am method pi ni o ba nyo ke fe na kanye. We have many methods you can use to protect yourself. In te ako tumo condom e, there is condom. There are pills. Wo ye fe nko ye bi e. There are injections. Ni ko te aba agbubu. Uh, I know kona chole emergency contraceptive no ndi chofa nike oke nu na bole alo oke yo na bole yo e ba ako na e condom to mbeni chon e condom e we aye mi enyo aye yo no na aye nu no boko ba bia ke mine wona sani ma fe planning ma fe family planning why must i do family planning eke okay? if you do family planning the first thing you attain is that health benefit to the woman and better maternal health care if you are a woman and you are pregnant and you have done proper planning, you can be able to take care of yourself, one, and the unborn child. This is achieved by going to the hospital to check yourself, so that the baby in you will be okay, and you, the mother, also, you'll be okay. I hope we are here. Now, we also see that since you are taking care of yourself, the man is involved. So it shouldn't be like the woman is pregnant, that is all. No. You, the man, must also help the woman through that process. So if you are here today and your wife is pregnant, as a man, get closer to your wife. If it is about money, give it to her to go to the hospital. If it is about care, get closer to her. Sometimes we realize that when women are pregnant, they leave and go and stay with their grandparents or their grandmothers. It is very wrong. When you do that, if you pack out your things to go and stay with your mother, by the time you come back, there will be another woman sitting in your marriage home, which is not good. Therefore, from today, whether you are a man or woman, if your wife is pregnant or you are pregnant, get together, live together so that you will be okay and there will be no problem in the future. Now, as I continue, it says reduce the need of unsafe abortion. We will see that young girls in this area sometimes get pregnant and the men that got them pregnant don't stay with them. The problem is that they don't have money. And when you don't have money and responsibility comes, if you don't take care, you run away. So if you're here today as a young girl, you have to understand that you are planning for your family or your future. Like we said, realizing your dreams. It means that as we are speaking to you, you also have to know that you have a responsibility. And now this responsibility is to help you to stop unsafe abortion. This means that if you want to go and have sex or you want to go and have what we call love relationship with someone, you must need or you need to know or understand the things involved in it. And I hope I'll mention some of them. And if you have a question at question time, you, you ask and we'll answer for you. I hope you are listening. Now, as I continue, we prevent unsafe pregnancy, like I said, and also pregnant related health risks like maternal mortality you will see that sometimes when a woman is pregnant and she goes to give birth and if care is not taken the baby dies or the mother dies this affects the family more because in the extended family we believe that the men or the women are in a particular family but in the nuclear family it is only the husband and the wife 
that are expected to move. Therefore, in the case where the wife dies, then it means there is problem in the family. But when you are doing a proper family planning, the woman will go for hospital checkups. Therefore, they will know the conditions she is in. Medicines will be given to her. And if she takes it well, by the supervising of the doctor and also the care of the husband, this maternal mortality will not be attained. But rather, the woman will give birth to a child and the baby will be okay and the woman will also be okay. No ni mean ready. Ke e ke yabalake wo bomode ni wo lene ke ni bi ne ni di family plan ye sani ne ni yo yen ho wo kele ya ilacha mo ye ni ye ilacha mo ye akole ake e ye egbomo tu emi e no ko ye mi ni e ba nye gbe na ni ke e te fomo mi e e ba nye gba na alo aha le tu fan ye na kan ni bi ai ni ke ko tu fan ni atun la ke ko ye ni doctor tun le ni bonu eni ji e fata lo bo wale ni ko ke te ne ya fo bo mo ya ba alo gbe ke na ba fo le ni na ni be eni ni be alo ehin me be ni e afe mo ko ni ehin e asra wo nan le chon ni ji e ba ba sin ni wo chon ake realize your dream e won chon ye ne ke ni bi ne ni ewabo ni wo be e o future e fe bright agbe ne wo ba na ke ke o fo pi e onyo ko gbe ke bi e bo ni bo bra fo nyo ba ke man nutrition and I said, no, no, break all the down, keba, kashoko. Ke ofo bi pi ni, obe shika. Eko ye ni, oto ni, oha me feni ni, papa na me ye. So shika she, e wano no ba fe ji, gali ye, aba ho, aba chile banku, na aba ye. Shike shika ye, aba ye fried rice. Alo aba ye, no ko ni banye, wakbe ke bi ye. Ni, ame banye ni, ame tashin. Ka te school, ni, oye shika, oba nyo pe, be ke bi ya school fees. Ko obe shika, oba fe ten ope. E wano no, oto nya, ji, wake kwa kenye ka fo, ni woke kwa ke o akenye ka na bole alo nye ka have sex ba ko ba have sex e le ne keni bi ne ni ke o ya fe e onyo na gbeno ni o ba nyo wa he ni wo be e saneko e ka ba what i'm saying is if you are able to know your plans for the future and you give birth to more than what you can take care of paying school fees will be difficult but if you have less children you can be able to pay their school fees and they will be able to finish their school and they will become some people or prominent people in the future therefore realizing your dreams are saying to you today is that you must know your plans for your future therefore so that you will not get yourself into trouble i hope we are here secondly when you are able to take care of your family and your children in the economy or the community you live there is peace you will not sleep one day and someone will break into your house you will not sleep one day and you hear ajuloe 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 amole hami you will not sit in your house and hear that there is people suffering street children because their parents are able to take care of them therefore family planning is very important but how and why must i plan for my family now people will say how can i plan there are many people who can help you to plan if you go to the hospital we have people there who will teach you more about family planning if you come closer to us on the board you will see our whatsapp number there when you whatsapp us or you call the number we will teach you more about how you can plan so that you will not get yourself into trouble let me you are the cocoa or border no obana ke telephone number ko ye no email address can you be fair fit i care oh yes and you can not only okay work by his honey she's a jba i don't know your share name okay baby boo no bala or number Ke mo twa wo wo ba wale na kan oni ke oto ila cha mo he aye meni atun ame na kan gbeno ni atun oni ke family plan ye ni ne ni ame ba wa bu e ja ke je no fia no ni wo live your dreams e oba nyo ke bu ye bi e si mo ke o twa wo oba na time ha bu ni oba nyo twa bu ke wo gbena ni sane ko bi mo ye o bi ye bi e mo si e ko ye ni e ya bala ke sane ko ye ni onyo no yo ye bi e ke o ti ben ke wo oba twa bu na kan ni bi fm ni mi wie ne wo ke kondo me ko e ba bi e wo ke pe o se ko e ba bi e ye bi e no oba twa be ni awo kondo me oba twa be ni ayu so pe o se ni mo ko ni e ko le o te hospital a twa bo si oyin e pa no oba na be na ayu so le ni mo ko ni oyu so kondo me kondo me nto yin ake aye yo no aye yo aye nu no ke wo ye fe ko ye bi e wo ko ba twa ye no e na mo e wa fi o si yin no le ko te pharmacy e fi aye oba na e ko ni ona be ni ayu sole ka ma ke condom e expiring date ka ma ke condom e ko wo lo jugo e ba nye dwa ni ke e dwa nu e ba ya yo e ke to e yo e ba yin ho 
Abe no kona atuwa lake nkele wo shikumepe. Once ni ukele wo ne nye wo boni. E wake ni ujibo no wo yuho. Mene biye. Wombobo wa maneke. Yani oyahe oho. No kwe yuwe. Ni nye nyo fe. Nye tash ni ejole. Eba. All I'm saying is. If you are here today. And you have impregnated a woman. Go and take responsibility. And take good care of the family. Because you may not know, your child may be coming the president. Your child may be coming me, speaking here, or sitting here, or standing here, speaking with you today. Your child may become our CEO. Your child may become anybody, like the president. Whether it is Mahama, or Nana Ado, Adankwa Ekufu Ado. The most important thing is, do the right thing, and you'll be able to reach far. So my CEO, let me have the condom. <laughs> this is the male condom. When you buy it, you have to press it. To see that there is no air inside. Let me try call here. Me amo. Here ona ke a fum a fumo a jope ready a papa ni. It's a no me am because call your koye me. No ni try ke condom eh a papa ni. E o condom fe ko na ho call me ani ona ke call your be mi pe brasa ni o chafu. Whether o ya hele ten cities, allow twenty cities, allow five cities, allow fifty pesos. Chafu a protect him. No ni jik. No need challenge. I am here to build your kejio. The woman in your midst, you are building me. You are building. I feel like I feel like zigzag. Germany, as I am, I'm not building. You can't build a Germany. You are not a condom. Now we are going to show you the male condom. How you have to use it. What you must know before you put it on. Therefore, with me as my CEO. To display the condom on the wooden penis for you to know how to place it on your penis before you insert it into a woman's vagina. Now I've told you that you have to press the condom to see that there is no air inside. Secondly, you have to open it by the place they have made the zigzag area. Don't use your teeth to open it. You may destroy the condom rubber. Because the condom is made of glitters, it's a rubber. Now when you use your teeth, you can pinch the rubber. It's like blowing air into a balloon and the balloon becoming small after the air goes out. That is the same way the condom would be if you use the wrong method of opening it. So now the condom has been opened and you can see it. Now, she's going to place it on the wooden penis. Now you make sure that your penis is fully erected. After you are aroused, your penis will be erected. Make sure you fix it rightly. Hold the tip of the condom to prevent air from going there. Why must you prevent the air? When you're having sex and there is air there, it can burst. When it bursts, it means you are not protected. So you hold that place very firm, you place it at the tip of the erected penis. Then you use your other hand to roll it down to cover the penis fully, like she is doing. I hope you are watching. Now, when it is ready like this, it means that you can have sex. You can only use the condom once. After that, you have to change it. Therefore, if you want to go for three rounds, four rounds, you need more than one condom. You can't use one condom for three rounds. It is not wash and wear. That after you finish, you can remove it and wash it and wear it. No. Once you ejaculate, which means when you realize that you have released, you have to bring your penis out so that the condom will not slip into the woman's vagina so that the woman will not get infected no mean to odi ko ke you are welcome the condom eh o ke wo open it say allo makola ke ta flat o gbe e ni o gbe te si o wo ba wo you to to e e won no ke le wo tan ni o release e ba allo o discharge e asa no ji e ko ji e no ni ba di condom eh e lose open it say lose of strength the worker by the neck and no gene is still okay. You ain't war. Condom me banye a GA a penny say near or you ain't. Care about a US in here, the banye bena will be Kuni Baba. Banke or no complaints about ye comedy. I'm complaining about a fibro can a canny be a good. Nina come and fit in any balana. The woman you walk on the me a top worker, no ya here. Leboni are you solely. The one in better be near or be a one can yake. Kai condom me or ya will like a because you can't use the condom anyhow. There are risks involved. But then to any or release it on. Obama condom me blow. No bad J ya you have vagina. Nikok bena koye toilet throw. Okay, but for the fe 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 
no ba die ke obeto le tro e no no ba fe ji ankechi o ba ni o ke mo mi no die ko die fold it nicely ke ka wo water closet toilet em ko ke wo mi e no bottle of if you are go e ba block le no no ba fe ji o ba no charge pon no ke wo o ba ni o ke fit a o to le tro e ni ke be se nu o ya sha o sha fe pe 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 ka si e classroom alo gbe he gbe ko ni me ton no no wona ji be ko ni school bi e ba ma gbe ni aba baba ke ko bo te school tun ni e o ba na di bi ko me je ni esa ni ke ba le na kan ko bo te park no gbe ke ni je chele o ba na ke ni bi ko me gele connect connect ko me ni esa ni ke ba le na kan ni ke ni bi fe e wa ye family plan ni e mi wo no use ko me to ele ke me he ko ni e ba wa ni mo ko e ka na ni mo ko e ka ko e ja ke ko o sile e ko e fi an e keke be ke bi e an ko ni no ni o fe no no na me ko no na me ke fi o what i'm saying is when you leave it anywhere just like that your children goes for it your children goes for it and they also try to do what you are doing and if you don't take care they can get pregnant and tomorrow teenage pregnancy will be on the rise you are not here to talk about teenage pregnancy but if you have a question about it you can ask so that we can answer now the second is the contraceptive pills let me have it now when we say the contraceptive pills this is a 28 days contraceptive pills there are other ones on the radio on the tv which are emergency contraceptives those ones are not to be taken regularly they are used emergency because you have had sex today and you didn't protect yourself you can take emergency contraceptive no ni mean ji ko ko no ni yen e bi e ene e wo ba ko la ke lidia contraceptive bi no ji aye different types bi e ma ke tem he mo no ni ba nye wa bo o nye ni o he ni o use keke na doctor dani o use see a doctor before you use it now aye 28 days no no ji no ni yen aye ko e ni nu e je 28 e ko ye e ten e ko ye ko me ni no at all contraceptive for emergency time e ko le ni o ke nu e awo o to ni o protect o e na kan be mi o ba nyo ko ka mix it to e ni ene wo e aye be ni akole wo bi mama ton ni e ko ye ni ke o ko e ko e ni o ka fa mistake the first thing you must know is there is a direction at the back of every contraceptive pill telling you where you must take it the white pills you see white ni e no ba na e contain no ko na at all e hormones omo nse ni yo yo e body ni tu yo ake mena e ba fe black alo e ba menstruate e won only people say fear ji e ya affect on omo nse ni e ka ni e release e ge ni ba ni e bi fertilize by the sperm say the worker o ko first one on the first day mako like mena 22nd o ko mena no jenshin o ba kwa ko me ko kwa ko me tell me no ko o bang mark e machine wo no ma o ma ki wo ka 12 o'clock e o ko le 12 o'clock the next day o ba ko le 12 o'clock pepepe o ko le na ka no ke ashi be ni o ba ni fe eta ke ma ko la ke o ko ko me ne ni o fe mistake ni wo o ko be ni ji eta o ba ni o ko enyo ti ke o ye pa no ni o forget for two days eh e ye ni e protect bo don as a no child for ni o ya practice condom eh Hello, abstinence. <laughs> All that I'm saying is, the first day you take the pills, you take the white one. The white ones are 21. They contain what we call hormones. The hormones affect the way you menstruate, the way the eggs are released. So now when you take white, the white on the first day, it will release the hormones to block the egg from reaching the sperms. Now you have to keep taking it till you finish the whole pack. If you take it 12 o'clock this morning, you have to continue taking it till you finish everything. If you make a mistake one day, you can take two the third day. But if you make a mistake two days, you can't use it again. You have to throw it away. Now, some women have what we call short menstrual cycle and some long menstrual cycle. How will you know? You will know by this. Today is 21st. 22nd maybe your blood came today you realize that you mark on the calendar till you see your blood again when you see the blood again 
between the time you saw the blood the first time and the other time you saw it will tell you whether you are on the long cycle or the short cycle. When you mention the yoko, you need to do a 28 day cycle in the year. Let no, if you have less, you have to do more. If you have to do more, you have to do more. If you have to do more, you have to do more. If you have to do more, you have to do more. If you have to do more, you have to do more. Ke ya si beni obana la eko owe Na kan piro de ni o na la afes ke Piro de de ba anada time e No di o menstrual cycle I hope it is clear So that you don't get yourself trouble E wo, po ya dwen ke o E kole mi la ke ba Mene 25 days time e ne ba E chon ke ke bo no di na kan yowye short cycle Mo kwenye ni le 28 days e ba ho fen ni le la Si le bako Ni no no wong chon di ke bo no na kan e yo Kana ni moko influence bonu ya kuto fan, ake kwa ya kwa la baba, kwa ya fe na kampe ubani yangu boi na, nuno ba fe nani? Yai la chamo yeye abawa bu. All that I'm saying is, if yours is short or long, don't let someone influence you to go and take medicine without the doctor's prescription. It's very dangerous. Therefore, whether you have, when you have a problem with your menstrual cycle, see a doctor. I hope it is clear. Now I will go straight forward to maternal health care on the paper we gave you. Then from there, my, bro my brother Peter Banfo will come and take you through domestic violence and some laws in Ghana. Then you can ask the questions you want. Now when we say maternal health care, it is the time the woman was pregnant to the time she gives birth and how she takes care of the baby. Hello? So when you are pregnant, the first day you realize that you are pregnant, you have to see a doctor. When you see the doctor, the doctor will tell you whether you should come back in two weeks' time, three weeks' time, or one month time. It will depend on individual. Now, the husband must go with the wife so that the wife will feel good that, oh, even though I'm pregnant, my husband is with me. Now, when you are pregnant, it doesn't mean stop having sex. No. Keep on having sex till the doctor tells you you have to stop it. Therefore, those who say I'm pregnant so I don't have sex, it's wrong. Hello? Now, you realize that when you are also pregnant, there are changes that come. Your body will change. Therefore, the man must also understand that certain things that you thought of the woman, like the breast standing firm, will change. The tummy of the lady will grow big. It is the womb which is expanding. All these signs tells you that you are in the stage of pregnancy. Hello, young girls here. Yeah? When you are pregnant, don't go and take any concussion, medicine, thinking that you can remove it. It's very dangerous. You can destroy your womb. And you will grow tomorrow, and you want a baby, and you can't have a baby. So all that I'm saying is, pregnancy is very important. The stage in being pregnant and the stage at which you give birth is very unique. All you need to do is to take good care of yourself so that you and the baby will be okay until you deliver a baby boy or a baby girl a sort of twins so that we come and do the kojemo or the adori now all i'm saying in ghana is this call your pet na doctor doctor about to back oh boy how you know me every two weeks a banana kwebu every one month a banana kwebu go to funny the new echo can you at the car let you find you call banana Na bwana kwa nyao no ito akeke owule alo oboye alo mono kele nye kana bole me ko me ifio na kana me sure bana ashie na me yae ko me nigu a ewa me no ni mintu akebe no baba wo ko kro ye o bana ishile ye ni no jino ko ni wonna ni won boye modin ake o ba wie ni wo chake wo suban fio ye ni ewa mom shi fio fio e wo ba se ye e wono mo ntun ji ko nyao ya hospital ni ko wo yo ho kele ya hospital ni doctor Equally, I'm gonna ask you be koni na kambe. Oba na kuyue muswe efia gbochon. Aye be ni ke bale na kwenye. Stay kome ni oba nyonge le wo. Enye fe possible. She doctor about chombo. Be ni alo be ni oba nyonge chombo kile na bole. Ne kabona. Hello, hello. All I'm saying is when you reach that stage, at the point nine, eight months or seven months going. You, you can't, can't do, do the, the normal, normal way you are having sex. sex. If, if you, you talk, talk to, to the doctor, doctor the doctor will tell you 
Yes, ways you, you can, can have sex so that you don't say I'm lagging or lacking in sex. Mm -hmm. At this point, I'll pause and take some questions. Or if no question, my brother Peter Banfo will come and continue. And when you finish, you can answer or ask any question you want. So let's. I'm also Peter Banfo from Realize the Dream Foundation. Are you here with me? Yes. 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 When we talk about domestic violence, there are parties or ways that one used to gain control over a partner. Hello. Papa yeah. like I say, you are married and you are at home. Always the man will be bullying the wife. You know about like it's normal because he pay a bride price, so he has the right to bully her. But it's not right. If you're a lady and you are here, you will feel well where you can report your husband. That guy she about money. Not that they will arrest him and put him in jail. But it's better you report so that someone might come in and settle your dispute. So that it might not be like the man is beating you. But when he's going to work, he wouldn't leave money, money on the table for you. He you, are, he has give, you have given birth to him. You, you are having about three children. You don't have to. Oh, yeah. You are hello. You are hello. You so that you put food on the table for the, table table for the kids. You are the man is also having money. You get it? So please, domestic violence is not all about you bullying someone. So that the way we talk to our like your husband or your wife, it's also part of domestic violence. Your, your husband will call you, mini mini, what should I do to you? Leave me alone. Sometimes us for example you are you are a kid and you are at home. Okay, oh papa, you jenny how bush car. It's fair domestic violence. It happens in the home, anything, any any petty thing that it it hurts your feelings. If the thing hurts you, please, you have to speak up. Don't keep it to yourself. Otherwise, the more the thing is hurting you, right, the more it will be killing you small, small. So please, domestic violence is very, very, something which is very critical. So we have to deal with it. Sometimes the wife will not even complain, but if you are around, Assuming I'm, I'm living with those couple and I know that ah, this wife is harassing the husband, I can go to the police station and go and report them. Yes, or oh, can't you do that? <laughs> yeah, you, can, you can report it for the husband or report it for the wife that ah, please, I live in a house, a particular house, always the man has been bullying the wife. They can take over and because when you go to a you know, police station, they have dogs. Hello. Hi. When you go to any police station, they have dogs. That you can report those cases there. Sometimes we have gender stereotypes. When we talk about gender stereotypes, it's about let, let's let me put it this way. So sometimes we the guy we, we think that we are more superior than the ladies. We how we feed them, it's not right. We have to show I'm the man, I'm the head of the house. It's true. The Bible says a man is the head of the house. But that doesn't mean that you are the head of the ladies, so you are supposed to beat her. Do anything that you like to her. You can cheat on her, but she can't cheat on you. It, people do that. But what is good for the goose is also good for the gander. So if you cheat on her, she also cheat on you. Don't complain. Hello. So please, when someone is bullying you or harassing you, please know the right thing to do. Make sure you talk to the person. Oh, please, you did this to me today. I